place here in Ohio's capital city. Hi to all of you, everyone, along with Eddie Olchek, Ray Ferraro coming up in just a moment. I'm Mike Emmerich, and we've reached game four of this series, and the team away from home has got a chance to really take a stranglehold. I think that's one of those things in playoff hockey, Doc, that uh, is needed. It's such a long grind to be able to try to win the Stanley Cup, but if you can end a series quickly, you give yourself an opportunity to rest your players and get ready for the next series. So you could really take hold of this series if you can find a way to go up three to one. Let's look at the starting netminders. A forgettable start last time. He got blown out. A must win for him to prove that he can stay in that goal crease in the future. Off a shutout victory, trying for more on that long playoff road tonight. Steven Stamkos, his 60 goals at age 22, won him the Rocket Richard Trophy. He'll shoot your lights out on the power play. Over a third of his goals come that way. Is able to move on in. that one measured in his own end. That's a free puck thanks to the play by Hedman. A one-timer save! Oh, great reaction there. Play stopped. Hey, Ray, you've got a closer look than we do. What are you noticing? Tampa Bay's players were telling us this morning about their need to stay focused and they want to get to 3-1 in this series. They feel they can wrap it up quickly if they can get that third win. to clear it here. Tried to clear, but couldn't. Cut that pass in his own end. And they've got it again. Columbus carrying it up the wing. Fires! And now it's directed to Miller. Offside stops the clock. A little under three minutes played here in the first. We are deadlocked at zero. Tampa Bay has won that neutral zone faceoff. Reads the play and keeps it. Oh, great cut! Snapping a pass to Johnson. Passing one off now to Jenner. Carries it on in from center. Tampa Bay's carrying it in the defensive zone. Trying to go to Johnson. Oh, good use of the body there. Slides it to the point. Shot, wonderful save. It didn't look like he had a thing to shoot at. The shooter thought he had a chance, but the goaltender robs him. What a stop. Directing that one to point. Tremendous hit. Savard's off to a really aggressive start. He gets a solid lick in as he tries to set the tone for his team physically. Terrific shot, but a save. Goalies have to make a half a dozen great stops in a win. This is one on a beautiful move, but there is nowhere for the puck to go. Won that battle in the dots. He scores off the crossbar. Oh, the key once you score one, try and get another. Push them back on their heels. They've got one, go get two. That is the first goal scored after a lot of work. Great start. They were ready to play, and it shows on the shot clock as well. The Blue Jackets from the neutral zone start to work. Puck loose, denied by the defense. 
Cooper. Time of the goal. Brings a shot. Got it in front of another one. Now that's a beautiful stop on a great scoring chance. A shot. They score. And they've tied the game up. I guess this game's not going to spread out. That goal ties it. The teams are so evenly matched. And they've taken that face off between the blue lines and won it. Reading Coburn assisted by number 17, Alexander. It's dumped in. Looking to Bjorkstrand. Moving it to Sedlak. Gains that offensive line. And at an angle to Wierenski. And a save. Tampa Bay's in possession as they travel up the wing. Callahan's tripped and a penalty should be coming. Columbus is given a two-minute minor for tripping. Oh, this is clearly a tripping call. He made no attempt to play the puck and took the legs out from the attacking player. Tampa Bay is getting the edge for the first time tonight with a power play. Always important to win the special teams battle, or at the very least, come out even. Quick wrister, save. The Blue Jackets shoot it back out. Got some time to check the clock and prepare to defend again. Tampa Bay's lugging it around in the neutral zone. Up to the point. Shoots. At least he protected his goaltender. He cleared that puck out of there. Still time on this power play, but not much. Columbus has taken care of that penalty kill, so we're back at full strength to the slot. Terrific save there. Didn't look like he had anything to shoot at, and he made it tough. Great opportunity. Better stop. Wabrowski's made a textbook stop here. He's in good shape positionally. He makes the save, and he makes it look really easy. Under nine minutes to be played here in the first. And so it is one to one. Puck dropped in the log jam, and the winger reached in and got it. Gains the zone to Zarelli. Columbus shifting gears back in the defensive zone. Great pass ahead. Terrific determination by Anderson. Good intercept in his own end. Pass attempt to Girardi. Laid on to Zarelli. Smart recovery by Atkinson. Pitching this one to Jenner. In the slot. Pad save. Ooh, hard one there. Face off and a solid tie up and help arrive. Good job. And he dumps it in. Puck is thrown to Panarin. Takes it in from the neutral zone. Smart recovery by Ryan Callahan. Pitching it to Puckett. They've got it. And now it's directed to Panarin. Great chance here, two on one. Snapping a pass to Paquette. It's dumped in. Picks it up back there. Passing one off now to Wierenski. Driving in from no man's land. Great job in his own end with that interception. And the referee's whistle has stopped play.
The face off, the tie up, and a solid job from the winger there. Many yards gained to Murray. Right next to the line. To Coburn. Trying to go to Kucherov. Tampa Bay is looking to head man up the wing. Intercepts that pass. Maybe he can generate something. Stole that pass. A good stick stop. He's able to make a stick save on a shot that really wasn't that challenging for him. They won that face off, trying to generate something. Using the point. And angle to Coburn. Nearing the final minute of play. Sends it back the other way, and he gets it back. Chips it back minute of play. with 55 to go. Directing that one to Dubinsky. 42 seconds showing. Terrific determination by Dubinsky. Tampa Bay setting up an offense from the wing. On the outside, a shot swept aside. And yet another save. How does he do that? He was in control on both of those saves. One period played, a goal scored each. That's been it. Pretty tight fisted here after the first. Hey fans, be sure to get your season tickets now at this year's playoff locations and prices. Pay the regular season ticket price for rounds one through three. Coburn's goal has tied this game. Intermission is coming up. Locations for next season. Stop by section 144 on the concourse. breaking goal. Looking to Dubois. Steps across that line. Good place to shoot from, and he does. Turned away with a stick. Free puck, thanks to the roadblock. Tampa Bay's carrying it up the wing. Chip to Miller. Wonderful stop. And he holds on and stops playing. You can't deliver the puck much better than that, but the goalie says no chance. That's an excellent save. Good offensive zone win. He saw it coming and he got in the way. Tampa Bay is carrying on up the wing. Got it in his own end. Crosses that line. Felino's trying to do way too much there with that offensive opportunity. Takes that pass at center, see if we can move something. Moving it to Stamkos. Pass attempt to Johnson. Pitching this one to Hedman. Takes it to the corner. He's into the slot. Loud pad save. The Blue Jackets are at the wing in neutral ice. A backhand shot. Caught in the lane and blocked it. A point hammer shot. He wore that puck on a hard shot. 
is thrown to McDonough. Tried, but it didn't work. Pitching it to Zarelli. Can start the attack going in the zone. And now it's directed to Bjorkstrand. Tripped up on the play, and there will be a penalty. An enormous hit. I wonder if that hit will change the momentum of this game. McDonough is going to the box. A player hit the ice, and the call on them is tripping. This is an easy call for the official, Doc. The player made no attempt to play the puck and just tripped up the attacking player. The Blue Jackets go on the power play for the first time. Just because it's your power play doesn't mean you can take a nap here. You have to work hard and continue to generate chances. Read that play in his own end. He's got this one, and they're after him. Snapping a pass to Jenner. Steps in from the neutral zone. Muscled long to Wierenski. Got his pad on a changing shot. Oh, he got in the way of that when it's blocked. Shoots. That puck hit him on the way to the net. Collected at the boards. Looks to make a play. A shot. Oh, tremendous stop by Domingue. Domingue is going to be able to make that save all day. His positioning is perfect. It's not a difficult scoring chance. A little under nine minutes have elapsed here in the second. Two goals so far, divided in half. Tampa Bay's taken care of that penalty kill and done it well. Fantastic poke check. And at an angle to Dubois. Wonderful save. What a skill level there. The goaltender shuts that one down and a superb opportunity. Gets it back. On to Zarelli. The pad came in handy that time. And he holds on and the whistle stops play. Pretty easy save for the goaltender as he just handles that. He handles about 100 of those in practice a day. They win the draw. What next? Back and forth they go between the points. Beside the line. Propelled to Coburn. Good defensive read with that one. Passing one off now to Coburn. I'd like to say that I think this game is going to open up and there's going to be all kinds of chances all over the place, but both teams have really adopted a never-give-an-inch style of play. I think this is tight checking right down to the final point. He can start some danger here. Slid to Miller. Goes for it. Waffle boarded. The pass is off the mark. What a chance that would have been. Poked away. And he dumps it in. Trying to go to Stamkos. Directing that one to Miller. Flings it. Terrific glove save. Fires. That's a great glove save. Well, it looks like the shooter's just trying to get this puck on net. Routine stop for the goaltender, not much challenge. Clean win on the draw. Tampa Bay is in control of the puck up the wing. Points it. Laid on to McDonough. Takes that pass up the boards and stays. Shoots it on. He scores! A pair of goals by the same team.
There's been a number of close chances here at either end as this continued tie game strung out. Now they've got the lead. We'll see where it takes us now. Tampa Bay's gotten the lead here late in the second period. Do we have one more surprise left in this period, or do we wait to the third? And that's a face-off win. Looking to Panarin. And he picks it up. Tampa Bay's lugging it in the neutral zone. Chip to Savard. Moving it to Panarin. Took that away in his own zone. Pass attempt to Callahan. Skates it into the zone. Turned a shot on net. Handled with the stick. Hangs on to that one for a stoppage in play. Oh, he'll take shots like that all night. Keep feeding him those muffins. He's going to stop every one of them. Just under three minutes left to go in the period. We had a tie game until just moments ago. It's a one-goal contest. Critical face-off win at that point. Deflected off the blocker. Pitching this one to Wierenski. The Blue Jackets have it up the wing. Pass cut, strong play. Dubinsky's thinking only offense here. They're down, and he wants to help his team climb back into this contest. On to Callahan. A superb hit. A great hockey play there. Wierenski's often been talked about as a 200-foot player. That means using your body, but just trying to get yourself around the ice with your skin. Puck controlled now by the defense. Leads that charge into the zone. Wonderful block. This is tiring labor. Loose puck, solid defensive play there. Just great positional play. 40 minutes have been played. Some hits given, some shots fired. But let's see what they have in mind as we get closer to the start of the third period and crunch time. Looking at the shots on goal through two periods here, 14 for Columbus and 14 for the Lightning. Tampa Bay's one goal lead came on this play. I want to show it to you one more time as we go to break. We are entering the third period. Based on the first two, what are you expecting to happen? The Blue Jackets are down on the scoreboard, Doc, and you know they have a real hot goaltender at the other end. Pretty simple formula. More people, more pucks than that. Eventually, you might get a bounce, and you'll be right back in this game. That one is pointed to him. Propelled to Hedman. Slid to Stamkos. Great save. Covered up just to slow things down. Bobrovsky's quick thinking allowed him to stop the play to slow down the pressure. They won that draw. Gathered up again by Steven Stamkos. Oh, wonderful play. Puck is thrown to Hedman. Pitching it to Kucherov. And now it's directed to Girardi. Puck loose. Strong defensive play by Stamkos. Important interception there. Good use of the stick. Broke that pass up. Laid on to Murray. Skilled play by Dan Girardi. Snapping a pass to Miller. That pass, he got in the lane of the shot and blocked it. Great defensive play with the stick. Great stick work prevents the pass from being complete. Chip to Felino. Columbus in possession, moving it up the wing. 
taken over again. Ripped along to Gore. Good shooting place. Columbus controlling play now in the defensive zone. And that one went offside. Been a long time since this wasn't the garden variety stop for a goalie. Down in the butterfly, turned aside. And they've won the faceoff. Good solid defensive play there. In that defensive zone, an important play. Over six minutes have been skated so far. And it is two to one the score in this one. Critical win of the draw. Great save. Pucks loose denied by the roadblock. Right in front. Passing one off now to Kalorn. A shot. Good work there in goal. He hangs on and gets the whistle. Tampa Bay's fans got back on their feet after watching the replay of that massive save on the big board. I don't think we're going to see a bigger save than that the rest of the night. From the faceoff, and they lock up, and a good reach. That's help from the wing. And he's hammered. You come through that area of the ice, somebody's looking to light you up. And the play is stopped on an icing call. Dubinsky's taken a huge hit, but he's continued to make the play. Good job on the draw. Tampa Bay's got it and moving up the wing. Trying to go to Zarelli. It's dumped in. Puck loose now picked up. Couldn't get through and retain possession. Tampa Bay is winging it at neutral ice. Lots on that to Ernie. On to Bjorkstrand. Directing that one to Sedlak. Brings it in for an attack. Gathered up by Nash. Right to the point. Very important steal for him. Oh, broke it up. Propelled the puck out. Terrific grab with the glove. He slowed down a bit, and there'll be a hooking penalty called on this one. The Blue Jackets get their goalie to the bench for the extra man. Tampa Bay's two-minute penalty is a minor, and the call is hooking. This was okay about 10 years ago. Not anymore. That's a hooking call. The Blue Jackets power play gets another chance to operate. Hasn't been effective yet. There's not much new to a power play. It works the same way all the time. You get a good zone entry, you get the puck to the point, you shoot it, you move the penalty killers around. Let's see if they can do it this time. Intercepted that one at an important place. Well, he just turned that puck over, Doc, but that looks like a guy trying to make so much happen, trying to get his team back in the game. Shoots. Can't get it on net. He was hoping for a little bit more with that chance, but his shot is just off the target. In with it now. Let's it go. Save. And decides to just hold on and get a stoppage of play. They lock up from the draw, and the teammate puts the grab on it. And thrown down to Ernie. Got it at the point. Cranks a shot. Oh, a save there. He scores! Three straight goals.
Edmonds' follow-through on a slap shot helped him score from the point. Wabrowski's not able to do much more than this, Edzo. He's in the right position. He makes the stop, although not all of it, as it just rolls past him into the net. Tampa Bay's gotten a huge goal. Now a little breathing room in the third period. The advantage is two, but the adrenaline will probably start to flow from the other side. Looking to Johnson. Slid to point. Moving it to Dubois. Is able to move on in. That's great defense. Fox still in the zone. Wide of the net. Oh, close call there. He's in the slot. The puck's on his stick, and he just misses. Tough break on that play. Using the point. He's got it. A shot. Wonderful save. What skill by both goalie and shooter. A quick developing play. He scores! Four unanswered goals. He's worked on this shot before because that's such a quick release and he snaps it home. That's the shot there, Edzo. Low to the stick side. The goaltender can't get to it. Tampa Bay's goal has taken them to an even larger lead on a night that they have had the offense going. Third period of play. Pass attempt to Stamkos. That puck is loose. No luck getting through that. Pitching this one to declare. Puck is thrown to Venber. Carries it on in from center. That puck's loose, defended away by Dubinsky. Long lead pass to Nudavara. Stick to some. Makes the stop and holds for the whistle. Under three minutes still to play in this period. They've scored again. Depending on which book you read, three may be the most dangerous hockey lead. We'll find out. The tie-up. He needed help, and he got it. Pitching it to Miller. Look out, the hits are coming. Nudavara's had a pretty narrow focus for much of this last part of the game. Things have not gone very well for his team, but he's been very physical throughout. Couldn't retain possession. And now it's directed to Felino. He's in on an onside play. He wore that puck on a hard shot. In the third period. We are in the last minute of regulation time. Able to go uncontested behind the net. Wasn't intentional. Didn't go well. Loose puck. The lane was jammed and it hit somebody. And he steps in. A shot. Broke it right up. He scores! Not done yet. He got him to the front of the net and was able to put in that second chance opportunity. Puts to the net need to be deflected into the corner. Because the goaltender can't do that, the goal scorer is able to pounce on the rebound. The Blue Jackets have closed the gap to just two. And there is time here in the third period to get another one or maybe get two and get this game back even. Neutral zone face off one. Possession established here. Marcus Laid on to point. Shoots one. Good save there. 19 minutes, 24 seconds. Snapping a pass to Bjorkstrand. Whistle is blown. And now the penalty will be handed out. 
Tampa Bay is only going to get two minutes on this call, but it was tripping. Well, in desperation mode, all he was trying to do was sweep the puck away, but unfortunately caught the player's skates. The power play is all about adjustments. They need to find a way to get more people and pucks to the net. Eddie, I'm with you on that. Power play beginning. After an ineffective power play earlier in the game, let's see if they can get a little more organized, get the puck into the zone and get it on net far more frequently. If you shoot or flip the puck out of play and it doesn't touch the attacking team or the glass, you will receive a minor penalty for delay a game. It is a five on three for a brief time, but still a two-man advantage and the face-off will start it off. You're right, Doc. This is a big advantage here. A five on three on the power play. It's one you have to capitalize on. No! Talking about being stake but he really has tonight. Set on further, they'll have to return. So now, just one win from ending the series. A 3-1 lead and a best of seven. At three to one in this series, it's on the edge of glory. I'm curious to see how these teams respond to the next one. Will it end or keep going? No time like playoff time. See you next time. Good night, all.